Hi, my name is Ted Gibson and I play Leroy. Leroy is someone who doesn't really look far ahead into the future. He's always trying to make the most out of the moment. His best friend is Ricky and they're about to enter a period of change that's really going to test their friendship. So to prepare for the role and for the film, I wanted to watch as many scary movies as possible just to get an idea of the world that we were trying to make. And so I watched films like Halloween and Scream, but I also really wanted to watch films like Superbad and Dazed and Confused that really encapsulated a small town budding friendship that is being pushed and tested. My favorite part about playing Leroy is that he's a character who just really wants to enjoy himself and make the most out of the moment. And so that gave me the chance to really enjoy myself while we were filming and on set. And I owe a lot of that to my fellow actor, Noah Diggs, who played Ricky. We became fast friends and that made it really easy just to bounce off of him while we were filming and just on set. So the fact that our friendship was so good behind the scenes really made our on-screen performances, I think, that much better. I really loved how Leroy and Ricky's stories were somewhat removed from the rest of the action, so it allowed us just to have scenes together, and we had some pretty fun moments where we were out in the middle of the woods, in the middle of the night, just filming this horror movie, but not really knowing that it was a horror movie, for us, it would have just been a, a buddy film, and the fact that we were able to insert this little buddy film within this slasher horror film is super exciting in my mind. Something really relatable about Leroy that I love is that while he's going through a big period of change in his life, which can seem scary, he just wants to make the most of it and live in the moment and spend time with the people in his life that he cares about. I think what I learned most from playing Leroy or what I wanted to take away from playing him was to not be afraid of saying some of the dumb stuff that pops into your head because it can be really funny. And also that the only person that you really have to please is yourself. I was never a big scary movie person before doing this project, but now that I've done it, I think I might watch more because I have a better idea of what happens behind the scenes, and I have a better sense of what's happening on set, behind the camera, between action and cut. I was really excited for the night when they were going to bring all the effects onto set because I wanted to know what kind of mess we were going to make and the kind of toys and tools we were going to be able to play around with that were going to really be fun to see on camera.